Welcome back folks to Scripting for Linguists. I am your host Earl Care Brown. In this video, I'd like to ask and answer this question. When using a handwritten hash map dictionary, is Mojo faster than Python and Julia when calculating the frequencies of many words? In a previous video, linked to above, I tested Mojo against Python um, to see if Mojo was faster using the default base Mojo, so to speak, dictionary type that had recently been released right before I made that video. And I was surprised to learn in that video that Mojo was seven times slower than Python when I used Mojo's native dictionary type. Again, at the time of recording, it was brand new, and they said that it, you know, it was going to be slow, it would be optimized later. But I was just curious to know. So I asked that question, I asked the question, why is Mojo's dictionary or for loop slower than Python's? on Mojo's, the Mojo language uh, GitHub repository, repo you might say. There are a couple answers and this person down here, Sereros, not sure how to pronounce that name, or that username, uh, mentioned this. There are both minimal hand rolled hash map and hash function that perform better than the standard library ones. And there's a link to another GitHub repo um, called Mojo hash from Maxime Zax, shout out to this person, Maxime Zax, um, for this GitHub repo, in which he implements different hash uh, functions. And there's one here, hash map sample, that implements an ha a hash map dictionary using a, a hash function there. And so I just simply downloaded this with git clone, right? Just git cloned it down to my hard drive, and I'm going to use it in this video. So let's take a look at our at the Mojo script. Again, this is basically identical, nearly identical from the previous uh, video, aside from using this hash map, as well as this um, hashing function, which I use right here, there. And so all I do is, again, the idea is I just simply want to hone in on creating an empty hash map dictionary, and then looping, looping over a bunch of words. In this case, I'm looping over 230 million words in one text file that come from the Spotify podcast data set. It's about a quarter of that data set. And I simply want to time that. Just simply create an empty hash map dictionary and loop over 230 million words and populate a dictionary calculating the frequencies. And then return out the frequency of the, just to make sure that we get the same frequencies, uh, same results from Mojo, and Python and Julia as well. And so I've done that. Let's go ahead and take a look at what I got. So I'm using Mojo version 070, which is the current release at the time of recording this video. And here are the results. I get 29.8 seconds there, 29.4 seconds there, 28.9, almost 29 and almost 29 there. Okay, good. That's awesome. And I did the same thing in Python. I'm just using the same script, nearly the same script as in the previous video. Here it is, here's the, the Python script. And again, I'm just focusing on the idea or the, the part of the script where I create an empty dictionary in line 15. And I loop over 230 million words and just populate a dictionary with the frequencies. And then I just return out the frequency of the, just to make sure I'm getting the exact same results. And we can take a look at those results, these five iterations in Python. Okay, so I'm using Python uh, version 3.12.2, which is the current uh, release at the time of recording. And I'm getting 32.3, 34.6, 32, almost 33 there, almost 33 there, and almost 33 there, or over, yeah, over 32 there. Good, so a little bit slower, just looking at those numbers, we're in the 28 region in, uh, in Mojo, and we're up in the 33 or so seconds. Now I mentioned Julia. I figured I'd throw Julia in the mix here, throw Julia in the fray of trying to see how quick they can, these three different languages can get through uh, 230 million words. And so I wrote, here's a Julia script that um, I wrote. And again, I'm just only timing the idea of creating an empty dictionary, which I do on line 14, and then looping over 230 million words, populating that dictionary with um, in that for loop there. And we can take a look at Julia's results. 
right down in here. I'm using Julia version 1.10.0, which is the current release at the time I'm recording this video. And I'm getting 18 seconds, 18.3 there, 18.3, uh, right under 18 seconds there, and 18.3 uh, seconds there. Again, I'm getting the exact same results uh, frequencies. I'm just using the as a way to make sure I'm getting the same results from all three languages. So yeah, 18 seconds is way uh, quicker than the other two. So if we jump over to a spreadsheet and look at our results, here are those five results from Mojo and Red, right? Right around 28, 29. And then uh, Python was around 33, 32 up to 34. And then Julia is right around 18. So if we look at the means and medians here, I have them down below already. If we look at the medians, what do we see here? Well, we see the mean time for Mojo was right under 29 seconds. The mean time for Python was right under 33 seconds. And the mean time for Julia was right above 18, 18 seconds there. So on the right hand side here under, um, under relative, let's take a look. If we call Python our base at 1.0, it's taking Mojo about 88% of the time that it takes Python to do this task, but it's taking Julia only 56% of the time that it takes Python to do this task. So I wasn't expecting that, um, but Julia wins out here. But to go back to our original question, when using a handwritten hash map dictionary, is Mojo faster than Python? Yes, Mojo is slightly faster than Python. It takes, uh, in, this, in this run here, this, this video, it took about 88 seconds or excuse me, 88% of the time that it took Python for Mojo to do its task. But Julia, the dark horse, came from behind and won, a, um, clearly won here, with um, um, only taking 56% of the time that it took Python to do the task. So yeah, this handwritten uh, hash map in, in Mojo does make it quicker, a lot quicker, from the, the native one that, again, is at the time of release, at the time of uh, recording this video, uh, the native one is much slower than this handwritten hash map from um, that GitHub repo. I appreciate that. By the way, I'll link to my three scripts below in the description of this video, as well as to the GitHub repo uh, with this hash map a dictionary object, as well as uh, my question on the main Mojo uh, GitHub repository. So there you go. If you are using Mojo and need to have a quicker dictionary, you can use um, the hash map dictionary in the, um, the Mojo hash GitHub repository. Thanks for joining. See you next time.